need to use the paper shredder. Paper shredder mode activated. And what will we be shredding? Trade Blase magazine. What the ha? Huh? Littlest pet shop, little shop, big success? Is it possible that all this publicity has actually resulted in Littlest Pet Shop taking sales away from largest ever? We don't know. With you girls as my witnesses, I will get to the bottom of this! Good for you, Daddy. Meanwhile, this will get to the bottom of, like, <laughs> the garbage! <laughs> wore me out. He was a sloth in name only. Russell, why do you feel so responsible for every pet that comes in here? Eh, I guess I want to make sure everyone has a great experience at Lilla's Pet Shop. Unlike some pets. Hey, Sunil and I take offense at that. Absolutely. It was a cross verbal affront at our mutual integrity. Uh, what he said. And furthermore, we can so show a pet a better time than you, Unfun Russell. Very well, then. I challenge you both to do just that with the very next pet who comes through that door. Oh, yeah? Well, then you are on, Mr. Unfun Russell. If we accomplish this, we will be rewarded day camp bragging rights over Russell. Major victory! And anyway, <laughs> how hard can it be? Hey, everybody. We've got a visitor. Meet Mr. Otto Von Fuzzlebutt. <laughs> All right! <laughs> <laughs> Otto Von Welcome to the day camp, Von Fuzzy Bottom. That's Von Fuzzle Butt. But please, no formalities. You can call me Mr. Von Fuzzle Butt. Well, I've got to get back. We're super busy today. What's a day camper gonna do to get some water and snacks around here? Good question. I have no idea. Ahem. Uh -huh. I mean, at your service, Von Fuzzle, uh, Mr. Von Fuzzle Butt. Yeah. <laughs> Aww, we got this good time stuff in the bag. <laughs> Looks like you both lucked out getting such an energetic visitor. Hey, don't worry about us. We can handle him just fine. Well, let me know when Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt gets bored. I'm sure it'll happen soon. All right, Mr. Von Fuzzle, but what fun, entertaining thing would you like to do now? Well, to tell you the truth, I, I really like it. What I'd like to do is, oh, what I'd like to do is, but to be honest with you, I really like it. What just happened, Mr. Von Fuzzle? What? Oh my goodness, gosh, Mr. Von Fuzzle, but get up! This is horribly mini. We brought Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt! Great! We must have bored him to sleep. We had abject failure as his day camp host. <laughs> Russell was right. Look, Sunil, nobody can know about this, especially Russell. But whatever shall we do? Everything we can to keep this catastrophe stroke a secret till we can fix it. <sighs> well, we'd best do it fast as Penny Ling is approaching. <laughs> <laughs> Take Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt on an exercise run. Oh, but Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt is the most charming pet I've ever met. Oh, and those eyes. Oh. <laughs> 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 Woo! 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 Um, I must admit, I never thought those two could keep up with that frisky raccoon. Oh, I just love how he stares so dreamily at me. Well, I like Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt and has magnificent tail to sit for a portrait as soon as he's done. He loved him! There you go, Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt. Indeed, that is perfect. Now, you must remain absolutely still, Ominka. Oh, 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 funny joke, man. 
Hmm, think you can do it? He's got it nailed, Vinny. Minka. Mr. Bun Fuzzle Butt made it easy. He never moved a muscle. Well, gotta run. Bye. I don't know how you got him to sit so still. He's a bundle of energy. I suggest we keep him right here, out of sight, for the rest of the day. Yeah, why not? And we've proven ourselves as eighth day camp host to Russell. According to him, old Chuckle Butt here looks like he's having a great time. Hey, fella. Oh. Life's gonna take it to the park. You too, Mr. Bun Fuzzle Butt. Oh. Come on. Ah. It'll be fun. <laughs> While still functioning as security robot, you're now also in full marketing analyst mode, are you not? Affirmative. Monban awaits marketing input. All right. Largest ever pet shop is losing business. At the same time, Littlest Pet Shop is gaining business. What is the one element Littlest has that Largest lacks? Calculating. <laughs> All this may strike you girls as silly, but I've built my business empire on solid marketing analysis results, and they're never wrong. I expect at the very least to gain from Mom and a concise new business plan. Calculation complete. Excellent. Tell us the reason that largest ever pet shop is losing sales to littlest pet shop, Mom Ben. Love. Love? Like, what does love have to do with the market? Or whatever? I have no idea, but you two are going to crack the code and figure out what it means. We are? You both will go to LPS disguised as ordinary customers on a little fact-finding mission. Us? Ordinary? It'll be just like a masquerade party, except there's no masquerade. And no party. Hmm? So, Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt, how did you get such a big tail? Wow! You wouldn't believe that story! Woo! He told us all about... It, didn't he? It's an ill. Oh, yes. Yes, absolutely. He said he was born with it. Oh, good to know. Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt sure has been quiet the whole way here. Yeah, yeah he's not much for small talk. <laughs> of course, he probably couldn't get a word in edgewise with his two new BFFs answering for him all the time. Well, go have fun, everyone. Woo, party! Let's go! Come on, guys! <laughs> Down your head. Feeling like you might give up, but you push on through instead. Learning how to survive, hanging by a thread. No time for sitting still, got the man watching us. A long move and all is lost, and it's making me quite nervous. We've got to make it, and we don't have time to fuss. Don't get too close to the fire. Living on the razor's edge, taking a life by the seat of the We could lose, and the jig is almost done. Could you give us a break here, please? Yeah, Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt. Searching for the answers to all life mysteries. I thought we were just trying not to get caught with Mr. Von Fuzzy B. Living life like an eagle as we learn how to fly. Maybe Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt is just a shy kind. Let's wait to blend in with the next group, or whatever. <laughs> Look, crude, simple pet toys. Who would, like, buy this? Well, there's no accounting for, like, taste. Ew, it's you-know-who. <laughs> and 
keep forgetting she like works here. Ew. Work. Help! Be right back, Mrs. Twombly. Come on, pets. Back to the daycare. Oh, my legs. Oh, my legs more. Woo! I don't care what they say. Raccoon puppetry is harder than it looks. I concur, my undersized buddy. Let's give Mr. Von Ways more than he looks at us. <sighs> I would like to just make it through this day. My legs feel like they're about to fall off. Well, do you suppose that mine make me feel like dancing? Because they don't. Listen, as far as I'm concerned... Hey, what did you do with Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt? Me? I thought you had him. Oh, fabulous. First we broke him, and now we've lost him. Oh, look, there he goes. Ah, Russell will never let us live this down. Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt, come back. Oh, he loves it when we chase him. You know, someday we're both just gonna laugh about this. Perhaps, but right now is not the least bit amusing. Look! Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt! Please, on the bus! Go back! Stop that raccoon! Sunil, maybe we should stash puzzle button the tubes until all this blows over. Good idea, my green scaly friend. But a good time. So, what did you make of this love idea over at Littlest Pet Shop? We didn't see any love whatsoever. We don't get why people shop there. We were so bored and, like, thirsty. But then, we, like, drank the most excellent water. Yeah, and then we saw Blight give water to, like, a tiny cat. Then, there was this whole herd of losers lined up to get a drink of... Let me guess. Water. Totally. Well, Mom Ben, what is your marketing analysis? The common denominator of this raw data is water. Hmm. Water, huh? Well, I can give them water. Behold, the largest ever pet shop water park extravaganza! Good for you, Daddy. I knew buying that water park right years ago would come in handy one day. Ah, lying down never felt so good. If this is wrong, I don't want to be right. Oh, Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt! Your owner will be here in five minutes to take you home. <laughs> okay, girls, cut the ribbon. I declare the LEPSWPE officially open. Uh, uh, excuse me, but where are the uh, reconstituted catfish treats? Aisle 212. But you'll get there quicker when you ride. <laughs> The brand new LEPSWP log flume. It's the high wet way to travel. Hi, hi, hi. And water! <laughs> Is that like all it like does? Hmm, 
I must admit I expected more. Maybe it needs more water. Well, the crew never had time to verbally bring me up to speed on how to operate this thing. How hard can it be? <laughs> Necessary, Russell. Yeah, and we really mean that. Wow, Mr. Von Fuzzlebutt must have enjoyed himself here. He looks really relaxed. Hmm? 